After almost no trading activity for 17 days, the EURUSD is finally waking up. So the price traded quite sharply yesterday. The reason for this is that the ECB is not as aggressive as the Federal Reserve. They did decide to stop their quantitative easing program. They did also decide to raise interest rates, which is probably going to happen next meeting. And then they're probably going to continue to raise interest rates, but they're not going as far as the Fed as well. They're not looking to reduce their balance sheet anytime soon. So what's happening is that the euro USD was in an uptrend and pushing higher, but yesterday it fell. So now it looks like it wants to trade lower. And it's not just here, it's weakness as well in the Aussie dollar, which was in an uptrend and that fell here as well. And it looks ready to head lower. You have the New Zealand dollar as well, which was in an uptrend and that fell here as well. It looks ready to head lower. And it's not even just there. You have it in, in the CAD, which flipped and turned bullish. Um, you also have uh, the dollar Swiss, which actually been bullish for quite some time. It breached here already. So it looks like more dollar strength going forward. There are, of course, risks. There's always risks, unfortunately, especially now with the summer. And the likelihood of having false breakouts is higher than usual. I hope you like this update. Give it a like if you want more. Thank you.